بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أحبت في الله إنما المؤمنون إخوة Verily the believers are brothers So with being brothers and sisters to one another we have to understand that that unity that tie that Allah has given us. It's a tie that Allah has given us. So it's not even really something that we have a choice. Although as human beings, we operate with a choice. We choose to be racist. We choose to be nationalistic. We choose to be tribalistic and take that over our Islamic ties that Allah Azza wa Jal has established. Inna al mu'minun ikhwa. Verily, the believers are brothers to one another. So we have to realize that the brotherhood is established by Allah Azza wa Jal. And that Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala says wa tasimu bi hablillahi jami'an wa la tafarraqu and adhere all of you steadfast to the rope of Allah and do not divide. So our adherence and our brotherhood is based It's based on Kitabillah wa Sunnah Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam. That this is established by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And that unity and that bond is by is adhering to the rope of Allah, which is the Quran and the Sunnah of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and the minhaj or the methodology of Ahl Sunnah. So be brothers, Ahl Sunnah and overlook one another's faults and assist one another in ta'awun ala bir wa taqwa wa la ta'awun ala ithmi wa udwan because when we cooperate in god fearfulness and taqwa and we avoid sinfulness sinfulness would be if we refute each other and become more and more vicious attacking one another's honor cursing one another maybe physical confrontations all of this is from the shaitan. And all of this is the opposite of ta'awun ala bir wa taqwa. Ahl sunnah should be strong one hand, cooperating, spreading ilm, to, uh, ilm and beneficial knowledge together, sharing that with the non-Muslims and sharing that with our brothers and sisters who, have, who are misguided and the general Muslim folk. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil and unite our hearts based on Kitabi Allah wa Sunnah Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam wa Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam ala Nabiya Muhammad wa ala Alihi wa Sahbihi wa Sallam